It is wise to check for updates regularly to ensure the functionality and safety of your computer. I'm going to open the Start menu, select Settings, and then Update and Security. Windows updates often fix newly discovered flaws in the operating system or in any of Microsoft's products. I will open Windows Update. I can select Check for Updates to check whether there are any updates that need to be made. It looks like my computer is up to date. Down below, we see this View Update History option. If I select this, we are provided with updates that have been installed on the computer and the dates on which they were installed. We can see driver updates from here as well. We'll talk more about drivers a little later. I'll select the back arrow. If I open Advanced Options, we have some update options that we can make. I want to receive updates for my other Microsoft products when Windows is updated, so I'm going to make sure this is turned on. I am also going to make sure Show a notification when your PC requires a restart to finish updating is turned on. We also have the option to pause updates. Pausing updates does not allow necessary updates to run, which can make your software vulnerable. If you are too busy to run an update, pause them, but be sure not to keep the updates paused for too long. The longest you can pause updates is for 35 days, after which you should run updates immediately. You will not be allowed to pause updates again until the previous updates have been made. I'll select the back arrow to return to the Windows Update page.